Kalani is in the hot seat right now and she's being labeled performative. Chris Brown uploaded this picture of himself and Kalani onto his Instagram story. This picture began to circulate and supporters wanted to know why Kalani didn't give Chris Brown the same treatment she gave Tori. A commenter wrote, if someone made a joke about my failed off myself attempt, he couldn't even be in my eye vicinity, but that's just me. Referring to a tweet Chris Brown made about Kalani in 2016, it reads, there is no attempting suicide. Stop flexing for the ground. Doing for sympathy so them comments under your pics don't look so bad. And that was just the beginning because now Kalani's baby father wants full custody of their daughter. Kalani and Javon welcomed Adia in 2019 but split up the following year. According to court docs obtained by TMZ, Javon says he believes Kalani's been mixed up with a cult for the past few years, which is influencing how she raises their five-year-old daughter. Javon's alleging the cult leader has a slew of sexual assault accusations and fears their daughter could be at risk of a without court intervention. In fact, he's claiming this cult leader's got Kalani under their thumb to such an extent. He's convinced her he's a threat to little Adea, which is why she's kept him from seeing his daughter. Bottom line, between Kalani's hectic tour schedule and her current environment, he doesn't think it's a fit for their daughter. You know the video where my homegirl's on live and I'm on her live and it's only like 30 people on the live and they're like, Kalani, what's new? And I'm like, I finally know I'm a lesbian. Well, it's true i am gay 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 but now my thing is right like when i want to have these like heart to heart to my family and my friends and i'm like guys <laughs> i finally know that i'm a, that i'm gay like i'm gay gay and they're like we know the stupid like duh i just feel like no like i want you to fall on the floor and be like <gasps> congratulations we had no idea Everyone's just like, duh. You really want to know the fucking closet was glass. So I guess I just wanted y'all to know that everyone knew but me. Javon not only got in contact with the courts, but according to him, he is not a gay male. Kaylani once said that white identified as bisexual, saying that helped their relationship blossom. He really understands my queerness and my fluidity, and I really understand his. A Twitter account wrote, YG is her ex, and her baby daddy is a gay man from Twitter, and she was hiding her pregnancy from Victoria Monet to keep her. Fed up with the gay rumors, Javon replied, I understand why she had to gas it up and act like I was a gay sperm donor to protect herself from the fake lesbian allegations. But I'm I'ma need y'all to stop calling me gay six years later again. People implying I'm a gay sperm donor when I'm a whole father is lame as and I'm not going to sit here and go along with it laugh out loud. Being outed as gay against any consent and getting homophobia thrown at me for years gets me tight. Don't push that on me. Set there a lot on my sexuality to protect whatever lesbian identity was working for them at the time and I caught all the flack for and it. And constantly get told to shut up before I ruin people's career.